The bond between brothers is unlike any other. A brother is the best friend you're born with, someone you can always count on. You put aside your differences and band together for strength and support. A brother is someone who will push you to be the man you are supposed to be. I just remember growing up, you know, competing in whatever we did, um, whether it be sports or building Legos or, you know, whatever it was. Um, we were always competing and uh, it definitely uh, put that competitiveness in us. I mean, it's paid off, I think. Here's the punt by Bryce Ramsey, high, hanging. Oh, oh fumbled by Timmons in Kentucky. Cats dive on it, we dive on it. I think we got it. Nathan Theus, the snapper, recovered the fumble. You see a lot of brothers play together growing up. But after high school, that seems to change. College becomes the time of separation. Sending siblings in different directions at different times to grow on their own. But not for these two. Playing in high school is, is awesome and Friday Night Lights, you know, there's nothing like it to go out there and we both played offensive line and we were together and, you know, kind of leaders and, and you know, we were successful at that. And then coming here, it's a completely different atmosphere. You have 125 guys, classes and, you know, you don't always live together and luckily now we live together and, you know, so. Our bond is stronger now. Nathan and John have been there for each other through it all. The happiness, the disappointments, the hard work. But it was more than just each other that brought them to this point in their lives. I don't think uh, me or either of my brothers would be here if it wasn't for the, the sacrifices that my parents made. Um, you know, they both worked our entire you know, us growing up, um, sometimes multiple jobs. You know, we definitely owe all that we have to them. And uh, to have three of us, you know, in college getting our education paid for is huge. And uh, it really, really shows what our parents did for us growing up. I think football's been, you know, a great opportunity for my family to, to grow together, to experience things, to make memories. And, and at the end of the day, it really created an opportunity for, for all three of us to get our college degree and to really set us up for life, you know, in future. So. You know, my parents made a lot of sacrifices growing up to be able to support us and to get us in this situation. And now all three of us are just grateful towards them for, for everything they've done. Recruiting isn't just about the football, the university, or the city. It's about the things that mold those into what they are. It's about the people, the teammates, the coaches. It's about something that these two brothers are used to family. The University of Georgia is a great family atmosphere and uh, you know they really do treat everyone with with the most respect and you know they treat them the best and they're really here for the players and so uh, you know I just felt comfortable at the University of Georgia and I knew some of the guys here and uh, you know it just felt like a second home to me from the minute I stepped on campus. Then it was John's turn to take the next step. All the recruiting is a grueling process when you're a top-tiered athlete. The decision wasn't so difficult knowing that part of his family was already in Athens. We're a lot alike, so uh, you know, I think it would, we knew we were going to have the same school. Um, so he obviously chose Georgia, and uh, I hadn't decided yet, but um, I knew by the time he decided that Georgia was my favorite. And then, you know, him coming here is kind of just the icing on the cake, so, you know, our personalities are very similar. So. We ended up liking the same school. When I came to school, we were definitely under the understanding that he was going to go wherever was best for him. And uh, really, he just had an inside look at the University of Georgia, and I was honest with him. And uh, you know, I wanted him to make the right decision that was best for him. And uh, I got real lucky. He came here, and you know, we've been together for multiple years, and always played together. But always doesn't always mean forever. Their time playing together is coming to an end, but they both realize how special this time in their life has been. It's just the fact that we're there for each other, you know. Um, you know, when I look over the sidelines and I see my brother there, it's pretty special. You know, he has my back no matter what, you know, whether I give up a sack, whether I have a great block. Just to have that support there for you is uh, pretty awesome. And you have teammates that are there for you, but, you know, nothing's like having a brother there. So, 
Um, I'll definitely miss that because, you know, we played together now for the past eight years, so it's been a big part of my life, and uh, I'm thankful for them. I think just having that comfort of knowing that no matter what I do on that field, I have a brother there who's going to be behind me no matter what, and same goes for him. And so I think it's just that comfort level of knowing that at the end of the day, we still have each other and we're in it together no matter what happens. Senior night for both Nathan and John. Their final night suiting up between the hedges will bring emotions they have never experienced. Another part of that night that will be new to them is having another brother on the sideline, the opposing sideline, playing against them. That brother, the youngest, Jeremiah. We've never played each other in a sport, uh, us Theus brothers. We've, we've always either been on the same team or the same organization but different age level you know so we've never actually competed against each other which is strange yeah it's gonna be a little bit different um, I think I'm happy he's not on the defensive side of the ball so we don't have to directly go against each other um, obviously the goal is to win it always is but uh, it will be a little change of scene because we've always been on the same teams competing for it all to you know come to this moment of all three of us on the same field you know for two of our final games will be a, a special moment their time at UGA may be coming to a close, but Athens, this university, this team, this family will never leave them. The G to me, um, it's my second family. Um, just to have all these people in the support group hold you accountable and push you every day. Um, you walk around and the people of Athens are you know, loving and caring. And uh, that's the reason I came here. And you know, to have this guy, the guys in this locker room um, that you come in, you goof around with, you work, you cry, you bleed with, that's really what it's all about. Um, that's what I know I'll miss the most about this place. Being a Georgia Bulldog is definitely an honor. This was a huge chapter in my life, and it still is, you know, and we're still writing it. And to be able to come back and just know that I was a part of, you know, Dog Nation or a part of the G or you know, a part of this team that means so much to me. I think it's just, it's really a family and, uh, you know, it's something that I hold, you know, near and dear to my heart. Hunker down!